Still man down. Fourth quarter brought to you by MedStar Union Memorial Hospital Sports Medicine and J. Dyer Strength and Conditioning from injury prevention and treatment to elite performance. Trust the sports medicine experts, J. Dyer. Fourth quarter rolling heavy. See who's had their motive cure today. possesses behind, guarded by the great defender, Spencer Parks. An early slide by the Crusaders, and now Michael Mayer matched up on Shaq Stanwick. And you just see the length of Michael Mayer. He is an asset to any defense. Just saw him standing next to Greg Pike. That's a uh, <laughs> good measuring stick. Shot goal, Michael Lynch. Go, Michael Lynch. Unassisted score, 11-2 Lakers, 11.04 to go here in the fourth quarter. That fourth quarter rolling on Boys Latin in their the home white. For the Crusaders. St. Paul's Road Blues. Booker Corrigan and inside lacrosse writer Ty Zanders bringing you the call. Ty, did you see Jeff Dudley down there? I did not. I saw him at work yesterday. I'll have to go uh, track him down. Emilio pushes it forward and reverses it back backwards. And St. Paul's back on the attack. Carter Flag, the freshman talent for St. Paul's. Sick rap check by BL's Aaron Leeds. And attackman Liam Anderson. Thought he may have been pushed, but leads. Talk about tenacity. New goalie in cage for BL. That's uh, number two, Colby Kaplan. BL has two goalies. Colby Kaplan, Christian Knight, committed to top Division One programs. Sometimes they split. Sometimes they rotate games. Right here, we saw Knight doing his job the first three quarters and Kaplan coming in the fourth. Get the save as we call it in baseball. Keegan O'Connor spins it behind to Stanwick. Stanwick detwags himself. A rare self detwagging. Can't say we've had a lot of those on CUDA.com, but the more things change, the more they stay the same. Had the pleasure of heading up to Philadelphia last weekend and covering the Katie Sampson Lacrosse Festival, an amazing event for an amazing cause. Spinal cord research and Greggy Pike giving a big hit, big hug to Colin Heacock. And we still have to sort out who's going to be that Under Armour All American underclassman player of the game. But Shaq Stanwick has clearly thrown his hat in the ring. I think he's done more than that, Book. I, I think uh, he's the de facto pick there. Still sticking with Pollins. Always fun having him in the interview. And uh, he's done a really, really good job today on Spencer Parks. Get his stick all over Spencer's hands. Pass out of bounds. Shot no good. They're going to call it a shot Correction. by B.J. Mathias. Remains St. Paul's ball. We are here at J. Duncan Smith Field, one of the great environments to play high school lacrosse or have the good fortune of covering high school lacrosse. Austin Tolan, little stop and go move going up against Casey Reese. Flag flies. And Linkus takes it for a spin behind, guarded by Leeds. Linkus now double teamed. Carries the double to the sideline, just like your coach to do. And then turns, get back to Parks. Parks shot wide. This man up brought to you by The Power Shaft. Get to www.thepowershaft.com. Flag on the play, cross-checking. St. Paul's being man to man for up to one minute.
Carter Flegg starts the man up for St. Paul's. Diagonal pass shot. Casey Larkin ends the scoring oh, drought. Casey Larkin, number 7-7. Seven, seven. Greg Luzon on the assist. And there's no quit in this St. Paul's cheering section either. Led by Tanner Brooks all afternoon. Still coming yes. hard. Hunter Moreland for the Lakers. But Mike Ty, for the I want to talk about the shootout for Soldiers event that's taking place here at BL in June. It's an amazing event for a great cause. Please teach us a little bit about it. Well, first off, it's been a pleasure to work with Tyler Steinhardt and, uh, you know, assist him with putting the, the event together. It'll be right here at BL. And uh, you can go to shootoutforsoldiers.com. Those benefits will go towards the Wounded Warrior Project. Uh, just an awesome cause. I know a lot of people have jumped on to help out with sponsorship. Um, it's been great to see the Baltimore lacrosse community really rally around this event, and hopefully they turn out uh, in, in droves come June 15th. And I know CUDA is a full supporter of that event, 24-hour lacrosse game. I know that it's my intention to come and play for 15 to 20 seconds maybe even 25 seconds, depending on how much running I do in the early going. I'm probably good for about a minute or so uh, in my young age. Try playing a fiddlestick tournament over Christmas, and uh, I was pretty winded for about three weeks afterwards, so we'll see how I do in a full-length field. But uh, just, just an awesome event. Uh, kudos to Tyler Steinhardt and, and uh, the crew work with him. It's going to be so much fun. A lot of college teams. Uh, North Carolina is coming out to support it big time. Some confusion on the sidelines, but St. Paul's still possesses. Here's Parks going up against Ponds. You see that positional defense by Mac Ponds. Parks runs off the pick. Nice save by Colby Kaplan. Ball into the stick of Aaron Leeds. Leeds throws a little sky whammy and spins it up top. BL's Greg Sheets pushes it down to Greggy Pike. And then you see he is definitely going to be a blocker at University of Georgia down in the SEC. St. Paul's Alex McGovern with the clear fourth quarter brought to you by J. Dyer Strength and Conditioning and MedStar Union Memorial Hospital Sports Medicine for injury prevention and treatment to elite performance. Trust the sports medicine experts, J. Dyer Strength and Conditioning and MedStar Union Memorial Hospital Sports Medicine. Another great save by Kaplan. And a little behind the back action by Aaron Leeds. Ball collected by BL's Walker Enzer. Gets it down the wing to Walsh. And Pridemore settles things for the Lakers. Still looking for a fan to show me the Royal Farms Cup to pick up the free Under Armour shirt. You can't beat it. Every game that Ty and I cover, if you bring me and show me a Royal Farms Cup, the first one gets a free Under Armour shirt. Not a bad deal. Before we get started, I'll show up to your house about 11 o'clock with a uh, Royal Farms Cup and uh, get that free shirt. That's all right with you? Is that kosher? Deal made. Okay. Rigo with the save. Flag on the far side. Man up brought to you by the Power Shaft. Get to thepowershaft.com to learn how you can get the best weighted lacrosse training Flag device the there is. Technical violation. Boys Latin will have man advantage for up to 30 seconds. BL man up. Motive Pure Hydration Formula is the best 
rehydration product on the market. Go to MotivePure.com to learn how you can be at your best when your team needs you the most. Motive Pure. BL second man up unit. Walsh spins it down the left side. Shot spun wide. Credit Walker ends her with the shot. And George Rice doing a nice job inside on the crease. Shot top side. Andrew Roswell Andrew came to drop bombs. Greg Sheets on the assist. And that makes it 12 to 3. The Lakers rolling heavy. Make Rural Farms your first stop before and after every game for everything from custom built subs and wraps, healthy snacks, drinks, fresh brewed coffee, and of course, Western fries and Royal Farms delicious, world famous, fresh, never frozen chicken. Royal Farms real fresh, real fast. Call on the field gives possession to St. Paul's. You're watching CUDA.com and the Royal Farms game of the week. Thanks for making CUDA part of your sports viewing day. Four minutes left here at Coys Latin. The Lakers putting themselves back on the map. With a statement type win here today. Any win in the MIAA is a big win. Patient Knocked ride by the Lakers. Boys Latin ball. behind gets it from Reese. This game, nothing like the 2010 edition of this rivalry. Uh, probably the best game I've ever seen. Triple overtime, Triple right? overtime right here. Kevin O'Neill scoring the game winner. Nice. Goal, Greg Pike. Greggy Pike. Unassisted. Word to your moms, I came to drop bombs. I got more rhymes than the Bible's got Psalms. So legit. From Annapolis, Gilman leading St. Mary's 11 to four at half. Wow. Calvert Hall 11-3 over Spalding in the third quarter. Crazy year in the MIAA this year, Todd. Can't predict it, Book. Cannot predict it. Loyola losing to St. Mary's on Saturday, crushing Severn. And St. Mary's getting worked by Gilman. It just getting it doesn't by add Gilman, up. Yep. It's like the guy on the buffalo. You know, you just have to keep saddle up your buffalo and ride him into the sunset. Pass too high for Walsh. Pass It'll be St. Paul's Saint possession. Paul's ball to clear. That's out of bounds, goes back to Boys Latin. Turnover with 2.39 left. 2.39 here to go. Score. Boys Latin leading 13-3. Most recent goal scored by Greggy Pike. And you have to know that he's going to go from the best high school lacrosse league in the country, the most competitive high school lacrosse league in the country, to the SEC to play football. Yep, I'm actually supposed to talk to uh, Greg after the game. Uh, we're doing a little bit of peace and the inside lacrosse on uh, football crossovers from lacrosse. It happens more than you would think. Uh, Gunnar Wall last year playing both sports with Brian right now. And, uh, referring to the St. Paul's goalie, led them the 2011 championship. 2010, excuse me. 
flag flies. And Go! Lakers get just a little bit more. Ben Levin. Number 29, Ben Levin on the unassisted score. Ben Levin keeping his feet moving the whole time. Draws the foul and comes away with the goal. Fourth quarter brought to you by MedStar Union Memorial Hospital Sports Medicine and J. Dyer Strength and Conditioning. From injury prevention and treatment to elite performance, trust the sports medicine experts. J. Dyer Strength and Conditioning, such a great job with the athletes that he works with. Man up face off here for the Lakers and the Crusaders pull Spencer Parks up onto the wing to fight for the ground ball. Hunter Moreland, quick win. Levin whistles one wide. And the Lakers clearly using their motive pure this week. And they're gonna need it. Friday, Gilman, next week, McDonough. So they're in playoff mode following this big rivalry game. They still have a couple big games that'll affect their playoff seating and position. Connor Keenan playing D on Levin. Another flag flies. Inside finish shot goal. BL's number 41, Walker Enzer finishes the play. Walker Enzer, number 41 on the score. Make Andrew Rural Farms Roswell your first assist. stop before and after every game for everything from custom built subs and wraps, healthy snacks, drinks, fresh brewed coffee, Western fries, and of course, Rural Farms delicious, world famous, fresh, never frozen chicken, Rural Farms, real fresh, real fast. Booker not completely certain uh, running up the score here is necessary, but I guess in this rivalry yeah. it happens. Wait, and I wouldn't say so much running up the score, just, you know, St. Paul's is continuing to press out and continuing to play defense and try and create turnovers and that also means that you're going to leave yourself open on the inside. And it's a lot of second and third Shout string guys who Laker are scoring the goals. So it's, no, it's cool to see them uh, get that opportunity. You know, those some tough games going forward that, uh, like you said, they need those wins to position them, you know, third or fourth seed maybe. Keegan O'Connor tries to connect with Cherry. Cherry, nifty little play on the sideline to maintain possession for the Lakers and a failure to advance call will give possession back over to the Crusaders. Michael Mayer will put it in motion. Stay classy. <laughs> you stay classy, San Diego. Colby Coplin goes down low to make that one. I reference San Diego, of course, discovered in 1904 by the Germans. The translation lost, scholars maintain. Can you tell me what diversity means? Diversity is an old, old wooden ship from the Civil War era. Okay. And, and we have a Laker it. victory! 15-3, Boys Latin. Please join us here on Friday as the Lakers host the Gilman School. 4 p.m. start on Jake Duncan Smith Field. CUDA.com and weekend Royal weekend Farms Boys Latin. from J. Duncan Huge Smith Field Dyson, Earhart, Gala, for Saturday Dual night. Cam Productions and we'll Ty Zanders. I'm Booker Corrigan saying so long from Boys Latin. Pride and tradition. <laughs>